Springtime on the bonsais when the fish start to feed very well. The fish are warming up, the conditions are improving and fish want to eat. The first thing to do when you get to your peg is assess the peg that you've drawn. With the bonsai lake every single peg is slightly different. Some pegs are only accessible via a feeder. You need to chuck or cast a feeder to the, to the bank side. It's not in the reach of a pole. So a small method feeder is the way to go. Not a big method feeder, just a nice 30 gram feeder that you can plop in at the side of the island. There's two baits to use on it. There's either ground bait or there's pellets. Both work very well at certain times. Fishing baits on the hook like maggots, corn, pellets are gonna catch you some fish. So just plop in a feeder to the island. The middle part of the swims are the, a place really that's only for fishing shallow now. Because there's a lot of sediment and the bottom is soft, fishing shallow is a good way to catch in the open water. And casters work very, very well in the springtime, as well as feeding either four mil pellets or even six mils if you're catching carp. So that's another method to fish in the open water. The other part of the swim that you need to look at is the margin. The margins on the bonsai can be quite deep. If you can find shallow water, ground bait and maggots works very, very well. But if you're fishing in slightly deeper water, then you're looking at feeding pellets, either micro pellets in a ball and maybe heavy baits like corn and six mil pellets in the deeper water is a good way to go because you can pin fish down on the bottom. So that's three different ways to fish on the bonsai that'll all work very well in the springtime.